Hello, everybody, and welcome to another Starfield Ship Showcase video. And without further ado, Digfig Industries introduces you to Shelly, the Combat Edition version of Shelly. Those guys over at HQ nail it every single time. Welcome to Shelly Combat Edition, a refit of the Norman's Shelly. This one's geared way more towards combat, and you're gonna notice a few differences here. First one being there's a second weapons pod over here on the right instead of a giant cargo pod. We made a few little up armored options, hidden some things away, just optimized this thing for combat all around. Let's begin our walk around talking about the cabin four cockpit. It's the same as it was before, still no ladders. We're having a little bit of remoduling inside, so we've got a ladder in there just for ease of access currently. But you'll see we've replaced the module cargo containers with these upgraded armor packages here with a little bit of better deflection for those pesky little ballistic rounds coming in. See one of two weapon pods here. And we've replaced one of the uh, weapons with some turrets so you can focus more on maneuvering and dogfighting, not have to worry about a third weapon system. You also have six massive landing gear now. We've up armored those and we've up armored it in here too. You can just see another example of our up armoring. This thing can take an absolute beating. Uh, we put six landing gear in here. So if you lose two or three or four, you can still touch this thing down safely. Another huge major refit here was the engines. We set them back, shrouded them more. Uh, added more armor down here with some deflection and it's just overall a great little package for combat back here your engines are tucked away and safe even if you lose two you can still fly on one with absolutely no problem whatsoever see here what i was talking about with the landing gear and the up armored and the biggest difference on this ship would be the second weapon pod over here now we're actually going to jump up on top if i got the boost pack to do it and taking some corporate cuts here Ooh, we can land here one other huge difference is we tucked away all of the fuel and the shield systems here. So you can see that the up armor up here is now completely solid across the top. Your turtle shell has no weaknesses. The enemy could shoot at this top for days and do absolutely nothing to you. It is beautiful up here. We've tucked away the shields, the fuel, everything is in a safe, secure location. Uh, we've created some revolutionary new radiator technology that sits right underneath the surface of this armor with our patented self-sealing technology. So you still have the wonderful cooling that comes with all of our Digfig Industries technology, but it's in a little bit better armored package. Got Vasco here protecting our secrets as always. Let's begin the interior tour part of this video. We have some extra construction going on here. So we've got some of the ladder ports opened up just for easy maneuverability and maintenance access. But do not worry, they will be removed before the ship heads out into combat. We start our adventure off in an armory here because we know you heroes like to loot everything you see. And we know if you're taking the combat version now, you're not going to be taking prisoners. So we omitted the brig and uh, we're going to poof through here. And we now have an infirmary because we also know that your companions sometimes have a hard time keeping up with your hero status and they take some damage. So we got a nice little place to patch them up right here when you come in We move into our first combat control room. This room is extra reinforced, the huge armor package on top, a little bit of extra armor on the bottom, but Shelly's designed to mostly take a beating from the top. But this place can keep your ship ticking and rolling all through the combat back there. And again, it's only one of two. We'll show the second one off when we get upstairs. But first, let's head into the C4 cockpit here. We have taken the liberty of reinforcing this goody, oldie, but a goody. I think it's the saying they say on Old Earth. But uh, we reinforce some structure here. Reinforce these windows with the new patented technology here at Dick Vigginis Trees. So you do not have to worry about any of those pesky lasers, projectiles, or particle things coming through your window and ruining your day. Turn around here. We're going to come into the crew quarters here. Put a nice little tree here we know combat is stressful and you need to relax sometimes and uh, a little bit of greenery does that We've got some nice comfy couches here to relax on we got three beds to sleep in shifts uh, and you got a toaster oven because we know bagel bites they help in combat but however there's no luxury here it's a combat edition ship there's no fancy kitchen nothing like that you're roughing it out there we're gonna move in here into a workshop where we have everything you could possibly need to repair your ship on the fly we know sometimes a pesky little crimson member puts around through your engine or something you gotta patch some things up you can do that here same with all of your equipment and armor move through here into the second combat control that's right we give you two combat sure. controls for your crew to sit here and monitor all their systems you can split them 50 50 they can run in conjunction or independently just a fully redundant system here to keep your shit up and running in combat hopefully you all enjoyed this little showcase of this ship 
Uh, yeah, we've got a build guide up for the other version of this, the bigger version, which you can modify down to this one. Link will be in the description for that and in the comments probably. And I'll put a little card up here and a pop up throughout the video because that's what we're doing. We're advertising, we're getting people to come to Dick Fig Industries and make our products. I really do appreciate it all. Thank you all so much for coming by and supporting the channel. It's absolutely great that we're blowing up again. And I will see you all in the next one. Dick Fig out. I think we nailed it. It's like 10 30 at recording this. Ooh, behind the scenes. Bye, everyone.